was an occasion of the grand reunion of members of the Democratic Party, Uganda's oldest political party, aged over 60 years. The former Uganda Young Democrats organized this historic event. Staunch DP member Kalungu West MP Joseph Gonzaga Sewungu was so happy with this DP unity that he sees himself in State House in the not too distant future. This is, this is one of the most, most, my happiest moments in life because all the demons that were disturbing us coming to our brains, some members have all come back. Don't you think I can stand as a president? I can. I can be a president. This party does not close out anybody. I am fit to be a president and I can contest and beat you very, very well. Seungu, it seems this happiness has blinded you to the reality on the political ground. Anyway, your fellow MP agrees with you, Mama Robina Sentong of Chotera. Tell us about those who bewitched the DP. Whoever had bewitched the Democratic Party has now collapsed. Life back into the Democratic Party, all those that had divided themselves, I'm happy that they are back because I'm new in the party, but I was frustrated to see people divided. But now I'm happy that they are back. Oh dear, thank God. However, don't be so fast in singing praises to heaven. Buana Seungu has received a new vision. He sees trouble ahead for DP. This, this is one of the most, most, my happiest moments in life because all the demons that we are disturbing us, coming to our brains, some members have all come back. <laughs> so, Wungu, that must have been a false vision, more like a mirage. <laughs> now, as DP lays strategies to take over state power, Inspector General of Police John Martino Kostochola has some quick advice to anyone arrested in the wrong manner. You arrest for us, those people. They are armed. No, but you can get a stone and stone them. <laughs> oh, Buano Chola. That would be mob action, taking the law into the common person's hands. <laughs> Oh, yes, Afandi, we knew you were joking. Definitely, you must be having serious fun at your relatively new job. It's as if every day is Christmas for you. I don't have any prestige. Huh? In fact, I'm enjoying my work. <laughs> Good for you, Buana IGP. You need to give tips to Kampala Lord Mayor Elias Lukwago. He seems unhappy at KCCA. We are strangers here, as if we are intruders, as if we should not be here, as if we are useless, totally useless here. Huh? These politicians, politicians, politicians. Perhaps Lukwago could do with these awards being given out by members of the Buganda NRM Party Youth Caucus. In fact, it is written here, the best performance award for Narebo Janet Kataham 7 for her exceptional service in the implementation of NRM Manifesto. We say Kongs to Mama Janet. Her son, the first son, also scooped an award, among many others who were awarded. That's why you have Jenum Hozka in Ugava as the best senior, one of the, the best senior president advisor. Please forgive my ignorance. But uh, how do you know that someone is an effective presidential advisor? Despite the fact that he is a soldier. Thanks to General Mohos as well. We are still in celebratory mood. Let's join our MPs in wishing the right honorable speaker, Rebecca Hadaga, a happy birthday. Oh, 
This was too much for the speaker. We don't want to know how old she is. All we know is that Mama Kadaga is doing a good job, not so honorable Cesri Ogwal. It's difficult for me to refer to you as the baby today, but I think you are our baby today. <laughs> and we are all very happy. Yes, not baby Kadaga, but big Kadaga. We say big is big. We can now have a social break here in Wasafi Market, Kampala. Just I want to help me, help me. For, because I'm ready for sleep in the street. Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs>